My name is Sherry Zahidi, and I have a Belgian Malinois, and his name is Tintin. I bought Tintin on Craigslist, and he was nine weeks old. He was, of course, adorable, and I fell in love with him from the first minute. At first, he was fine. He would listen very well. He was really a great dog. You know, I thought this was going to be easy. And then around the fifth or sixth month, uh, we noticed the change. He would start barking at bicyclists, he would start barking at people. He even ran out and he almost attacked a lady. And animal control really told us that we have to get a trainer, otherwise we can't keep the dog. We first brought someone. He started by putting a prong collar on Tintin. And as we were walking, he would just pull like that, like he would just pull her in the air with the throat, you know? The next day, Tintin jumped up and bit my mom. I kind of put a two and two together and I thought that something is not right, something is not working with this trainer. After that I just really felt like I was hopeless. I really didn't know where else to go. I took him to the Humane Society and I said either take him or you know give me a trainer or something and I was just crying and the lady at the front desk basically said to me maybe we could get him to jog with someone. I thought maybe if Tintin took out his energy he would be calmer. My father actually found a company, so we called and they said, based on the interview, we do not accept your dog because he's too aggressive. And then they referred me to Elisa, uh, Legends Dog Training. I called Elisa and we made an appointment to meet. In the first meeting, I already had a good feeling because she asked all the right questions. And then she gave me a plan. After the first training session, I already felt relief because I felt like someone was able to evaluate my dog properly, was able to give me feedback on my dog, and I felt like this was going in the right direction because there was structure. The way that she explained things is very clear. First she shows you, then she has you do the training with the dog, and she explains to you the reason why she's doing it. She was telling me how to become my dog's trainer. Little by little, I started to become more comfortable with him and he started to become more comfortable with me. I kind of got my dog back and I didn't have all that frustration and panic that I had before. And that was amazing that I found out that this dog is just actually very intelligent. The communication that I have with Tintin is amazing. He knows that when he has stress, when he has anxiety, he can turn to me and we can find together a way to calm them down. With the different training methods that I you know, experienced, this for me works the best because it helps me understand my dog better. It helps me understand what I want from my dog and how my dog reacts to things. That for me is really amazing.